Hello, hello guys and welcome back to Astronage. In this episode we are taking on Corruption 11. Also, another update. 1.3.4. This update have uh, changed the merchant a little bit. Um, you can re-roll the merchant for, I think it was 15 gold. And there will also be one more innocent item instead of, um, instead of a pot, instead of a potion. A couple of uh, gear changes as well, but not not directly, indirectly. Many many of the many of the changes that was uh, doing something before the combat happened is now being more well directly impacted in, in that uh, in that aspect that it will actually be beneficial for you even more. It will be applied in a very beneficial way. So m more of the items, I, d I don't really, I can't really even recall the item that does that. But uh, there are plenty of them, like at least five or six of them. So we will probably encounter one of them. Anyway, who should we pick? My thought is we should probably pick someone with uh, a rank one and then pick, well, something good after that. Uh, the Warlock? Yeah, I don't know. You know what, I really like the wild mage, so why not take him? He's on corruption one. Um then we probably who should we take with him? See he, he likes to be hit a couple of times here and there. He likes to be a mage, but also one that is being hit. So he wants shields and I I, I mean the paladin seems like a good choice here. That seems like a really good choice um, and then we probably need either either a healer or someone that can do a lot of damage or maybe both things maybe the warlock or the blood mage I mean there is not a lot of single target damage here hmm. I think we're gonna go with the blood mage I mean, he likes to be. Um, he likes also to take some damage, but he can take damage in other ways. <laughs> uh, yeah. Okay. Okay. I'm good with that. I'm good with that. Here we go. Here we go. Ooh. Hmm. You know what? Reduce the cost. Reduce the cost of active abilities. All three of them got some really good um, active abilities that they want to use as well. Uh, let's see, what are we gonna go with here? Hmm. So that's actually a little bit too early with the elite, but I think we can't we can get... There's one of them that we can get. I think we're gonna go for this one down here, because this one is just tough. Tough as fuck. And uh, there's also a merchant over here instead, so these two fights over here is gonna be really, really hard. Um, yeah, I, I think we're gonna go down here to begin with. We might go up to take an event, but uh, Salamander. Oh, oh! I, I think I forgot. I think I forgot to to mention it. I actually did the speed run. I don't know if I did if I said that in the last. Uh, I, I pro no, I don't think I don't think I did. So I I, I won the speed run, 23 minutes and I think it was 18 seconds. So I did that in in good time, no problem. That was actually uh, not too bad. Wow, that was close for the Paladin. Um, hmm. Yeah, none of these are really fast. Well, actually, the Wild Mace is pretty fast. That might actually be very helpful for him. But... Oh, I, th I think we're going to take that instead. Because that could also be helpful on the wild mage later on. And uh, let's see. Yeah, there's one more battle down here. Uh, th this guy's a little bit worrying because he's gonna steal my paladin's um, health. But yeah, that was uh, it. Was not a problem winning that uh, 30 minutes. I mean, it, I I don't I don't I don't have a ton of fun when I'm playing on uh, on a counter or on a what is it called a clock. Um, it's, it, yeah, I just don't feel like that's a good way to play a game, uh, ever. <laughs> hmm. 
That might be a good thing for the wild mage because his ability is gonna cost less and less. So, you know, and he's also getting some starting MP. Not a bad little thing. And also I can sell it again if I don't want it, but it's actually not a bad item. But I'd rather have some more shield for him, to be honest. Uh, poison all enemies. Right, it's fine, that's fine. Yeah. We don't have a ton of damage here, but uh, um, we might be alright. Hmm. Oh, that's that's decent for him. That's definitely a good item for him. Ah, the bat. Okay, well here is where we could potentially have a big problem. Um, but let's see, because we don't have a ton of damage here. And I don't think he's actually hitting the wild mage. Yeah, I, th I think I think the paladin is gonna die. He's also stealing our health. Ah, we might be okay. That was a lot better than I expected. Ah, what do we have? Hmm. Yeah, there is not really anything here that I like. I think I'm gonna take this one just to sell it, probably. Uh, event or event? Well, I don't really feel like taking this merchant, so I think we're going up here to the event and then that up here and going back to the elite. Oh, can we lose 8 morale? Yeah. Oh, that's not good. That's not good. That was not what I wanted. But okay, whatever. Um, Yeah, that's the top. Wait, what? Did we just get two times in a row? And No, we didn't because we just got that one. But this is a tough battle and that's gonna be one that we're gonna lose, I think. Uh, yeah, I don't see us winning this one. Uh, I don't see us win winning this one. This is a real tough battle, man. I don't know. Yeah, okay, well, we might not lose it, but... Damn, that was not the battle we wanted. I do like the Noble Ward. You can have it. Elite battle, okay. We should be fine here, but I'm honestly not sure. Honestly, not 100% on this. Well, let's see. Oh god. Oh god. Oh. Come on. Oh, Jesus. All oh, the shields. They went. They, whew, they saved us. Uh. Hmm. That's a tough choice. I think I'm gonna go with the frozen shell. We don't have any f uh, frost right here, but um, just the 15 defense alone is uh, actually pretty good on him. Village orb. Ooh. See who are we gonna go for here? That's not a bad shout. The shield is also pretty good, but um, yeah, none of their passives are really that great. I'm gonna go with blood mage. Should probably go with wild mage, but um. I guess an event and then one more. Uh, damn, it's, that's gonna be a tough fight down there. That's probably the holy water gone. Maybe silence? I don't know. Uh, ooh. Half my morale again? <laughs> I think I'm gonna take the 5% speed because I'm, I'm very worried about this fight down here. And the 5% speed could be what exactly what we need to win it. 
I don't really feel like taking another hit to my morale. No, not just yet, at least. Ah. Uh, 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 I don't know about it. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna keep them on the same lane because all of them, well, the Wild Mage and the Blood Mage both, both could gain something from uh, taking that hit. And I think he can outheal it anyway. So it might be a good idea actually to keep them on the same lane so, you all, so they all got shields and stuff. Mm, yeah, right. Go for it. Go for it. Oh, I don't know. It might be alright. The shields from the Paladin is very, very helpful. Nice. A tower shield? Okay. Another Oaken Nut. Oh, I, I, I don't think I mind that. Let's take that, actually. Uh, the shields are really strong, um, but... I, I, I think this is just way better, or even this. But I think this is just way better. That is what I... If I need any damage from this team, well, it's gonna come from the Wild Mage or someone else that we pick. But we're definitely gonna pick double damage next time uh, we are coming back. Uh, then we got a couple of normal fights here that is gonna be, uh, well, painful, I think. <laughs> uh, Jesus. Oh, that's... Yeah, I think that's how we're gonna set up. I mean, the Wild Mage is probably gonna get, uh, well, killed. Oh, you know what? I don't mind using this here. I actually don't mind using that. Because this is a really tough fight. Let's make them burn. Okay. Ah, yeah, there we go. Can't really... Can't really do anything about that. Well, maybe I could have let the Paladin tank that and... I don't know. I don't know. Maybe. Oh, that's a really good item for us. Another Oaken Nut. Holy shit. See, some, something like this. At the start of combat, reduce the attack and defense of all enemies. That is gonna be applied in a very... Um, in a way that y it's it's advantage for you. If, if there was a... If it... Before, it would maybe not have taken into advantage something else. Now it does. But sh I, like I said, I, I, I don't really see the combination. But there is definitely items where it would be combined. Especially on, when it's on yourself. Like the tower shield, actually. Applying first the tower shield and then applying something that gives even more defense from whatever. Or, you know, that is what he had changed in this patch. <laughs> the Oaken Nut is very... <laughs> Uh, tempting, but uh, I, th I think the bound elements is probably uh, where we're gonna go here. I mean, uh, it, it's not a good build for the wild mage at all. This very odd. Uh, I mean, it's not bad either, but not exactly what I wanted. Uh, I, I definitely need something damage. I, I don't know what character we're gonna choose next time, um, but we definitely need some. Ooh. Uh, you know, that, that that might actually work out. Uh, that might work out, actually. Uh, negative effect, silence. Uh, Stun. I'm not sure I want to use... I mean, we got 17 morale here, so I might want to... Not... Let's see. Oh, God, the Paladin's getting... It might be good. It might be fine, because we're also getting healed, so... Oh, that's a big hit on the wild mate. Flick, heal him. Yeah, good. Okay, nice. Oh, again, not not the items that I'm looking for. Not at all. But yeah, I I don't. I don't know. take that and give this to to the wild mage so he can gain some more MP yeah not exactly what I was looking for again but whatever uh, event and then the merchant we can probably only upgrade once but okay select an upgraded item all heroes start with 
30 less max health next combat. Lose 8 morale. Uh, I'm tempted to go for the morale head. Uh, yeah, sure. Let's go for the morale head. The Noble Wall seems pretty good here. Instead of the Frozen Shell. That Negate is definitely good. Was it worth my 8 morale hit? Yeah, I don't know. It probably is. It's definitely a good... Here, here early on is really, really good. It's a lot of health, a lot of defense, and the 4 Negate is definitely good. Uh, he actually got 6 Negate here. So yeah, go figure. Oh yeah, there is another Anison here. Uh, restock, so for 15 we can actually restock. Click to restock the merchant with new items. Nice. I'm not gonna do that probably. Uh, I don't want any of these. No. Yeah, no. Um, oh, nope, 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 no. That was not the, not, not the correct mage with me here. No, he actually needed um, he he needed a symbiote or lich wraps or something like that instead. That's what he wanted the wild mage. Um, hmm. I mean, he's doing fine. I mean, it's it's pretty good damage here from him. Not bad at all, but you know, actually, this one is actually quite good on him. That is actually he just needs symbiote and lich wrap. Then he is uh, gonna go crazy. And that means we actually got spare. Yeah, we got we got we got a decent speed build here going. So we probably are gonna choose someone that is um, a little bit more single target minded. Mm, Ronan maybe? Nah, he's actually. I don't know. Hmm. The assassin is a pretty decent choice, but I don't want him yet. I'll probably take him as a fifth option, but whatever. Uh, what are we gonna upgrade here? Oh, tough. Actually, this one might be a really good, strong choice. 20% speed, wow. And Oaken Notch could potentially be it. Don't really want to go for this one. <laughs> because I'm using my gold, so I don't really. Uh, the Noble Ward is also not bad at all. There's nothing really obvious. I think I'm gonna go for the Songbird because I actually think it's really good on the Wild Mage. He's gonna go crazy with that speed. Oh wait, it's only gonna get applied once, right? Your active ability, yeah, increases your speed by 20%. Okay, so it's just a speed build basically uh, for him. I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't. I might go with the Noble One instead because it's just a really good item here early on and in the mid game. And it can be helpful on someone else as well. Champion's guard is also pretty decent. I mean, more attack. I mean, he he is quite fast. 1.9. Yeah, not fast, fast, but oh, tough choice. What what is what is it actually doing? Two minor curses. Nah. Let's just give the blood mage a little bit more health then. Uh, I do really like the oak knot on him, so uh, I don't mind it. I don't mind it. Uh, ho ooh, holy charm might be decent choice here for the paladin, actually, or even for the blood mage because of the health. You know what? I think I'm gonna go for that. Or am I? It's not bad at all. I mean, just stacking health on this guy is very, very good. And I don't really see a use for this particular item. So let's take that. Can we? Uh, no, we can't. We can't. And we do need some items for uh, a new guy that we are going to choose. I mean, I don't really see. Uh, yeah, we're probably going to take the speeds. And yeah, I don't know what we're going to do with this. It's not really. Um, really anything. Not really anything for a new guy. But anyway, let's get into the event. What do we have? Oh, the dogs. You know what, let's let the wild mage tank a little bit here, because I think we're gonna kill that guy really quick, oh, this dog up here really quick. Uh, oh, it's not a dog, it's a wolf, whatever. Um, 
And if we can take the first dog out really quickly, and the wild mage can take some damage, which means he's gonna do more damage to, be, to, to begin early on with, that would maybe make sure that we are doing enough damage to actually kill them off before they are, what is it, howling, howling some more uh, enemies in. Go ahead. But he don't have a big shield. But he will gain more shield. Hopefully, before he's dying. Please, Paladin. Okay, okay. No. Not good. We're dead. No good. Not even close. You need a lot of burst damage to, to kill these. Hmm. Ah, we missed out on the Hero Sigil. That's a very nice item for the Wild Mage. Even on someone else. Just getting that little bit more shield on. Well, it is what it is. Boss fight. Yeah, that's... Uh, this could be a little bit tough, but I mean, he's pretty slow. So that's not too bad in that sense, but... Oh, goddy goddy. Oh, goddy goddy. Yeah, I think the holy water and maybe the sun will help us, but... Can we outheal him? Maybe we outheal him. Pretty close to outhealing him, actually. Except from when he is doing that uh, elimination protocol. That's a big one. But yeah, we are doing quite fine here. Our sustainability here is really killing him. The Blood Mage is absolutely uh, doing uh, a good work here. Yeah, just stacking health on him is just so insane. Um... Oh. Oh, that would be interesting. I mean, just, just giving him that shield. I mean, he's already built for speed. See, I'm not sure if... Uh, it was definitely the item I wanted, no matter what. Um, but are we building that on the mage or someone else? I don't know. But it, it's not a bad thing on the mage. He just needs... I don't know what... I mean, take that off. Actually, wait, wait, hold on. We need to figure out who we're going to take. But, but if we're taking... I mean, if we're building into the wild mage really heavily here... Uh, I think the songbird is pretty decent on him, and he do like to get some speed, if you get this. That's only 25, but this just having that shield makes sure that uh, his uh, passive is working really, really often. So he will, he will, um, yeah, deal 25% damage to all enemies. So we, we are just stacking a bit of damage on him. Speed and... Yeah, that's actually not bad. <laughs> uh, but he's not going to be really, really good before we're getting some other items. We m The Songbird might not be helping out. But that, that might actually be a, a pretty decent build for him. Because we can use him as an off tank right now. Because he's gaining uh, some shield. And he's... Yeah, that's, that might be good. Um, who are we going to pick? Jesus. I, I still think we need someone built for speed and single target. Um, mm, yeah, I mean the Warlock is actually not bad, he's 1.6 and 50 attack, we just built him for speed, uh, and he's also, also going to heal quite a, quite a lot. The Ronin is decent, but... He's not very fast to begin with. Maybe the brawler. I haven't. I haven't. I don't really often pick the brawler. He, he might be a good shout. He might be a good shout. Yeah, let's take the brawler. He's actually not bad at all. In this case, in this case, with this scenario here, I feel like he's he's quite good. Oh, we can't give him anything. Let's move on. He's also one that we really need to upgrade. Um, he's only on 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 corruption two, I think. 
Yeah, that's actually not too bad. We got more than it is on one, so... I mean, he's not gonna be very speedy here, but uh, he's gonna be decent, and he can steal a bit of their stuff here. Actually, you know what? He's probably more North Tank than the Wild Mage is, because the Wild Mage is still gonna do a massive amount of damage just... I mean, I mean, I still want to be, I, I, yeah, I still want to build the mage into uh, Lich Wraps and Symbiote if we get that. And the Great Staff is still pretty good on on the Brawler if he want, if he if he get actually uh, hold on, let's see, uh, let's keep let's keep it on the Wild Mage for now because it's actually really really good on him. I, I think the Assassin is probably our fifth choice here, more than likely. The Brawler actually needs to be able to take some hits. Or the Wild Mage. Probably the Wild Mage, but who knows. Okay, who is gonna get... Well, this is actually not bad. This is actually not a bad thing. Um, but it is an active, and who is best with active right now? Probably the Wild Mage. Ah, you know what? This, this is also really strong. I'm gonna go with that. But I think I'm gonna go with this on the Brawler. I think that's the best passive we can actually upgrade here. I mean, the Blood Mage's act, uh, passive is also pretty good, but we already upgraded it once. Uh, I think the Brawler's passive is actually really good for a single target DPS, so we are gonna go with that. We got plenty of pots. All heroes deal 20 piercing damage to attackers. I mean, we got three guys that are actually quite fast, all of them. None of them are really scaling with speed, but still it's pretty good. All merchants are mm, items received from combat and events are twice as likely to appear upgraded. We don't have a lot of upgraded things, so I think I might go with that. Yeah, give me that. Mother rats. Uh, what is this? I don't remember. I don't remember. Uh, yeah, this one up here is uh, the guy that is bleeding us. Don't remember this one, but we are probably gonna go for all three. And I guess this merchant, or maybe that merchant, depends. Yeah, probably this merchant because we can avoid. Then we can avoid this fight here. But where are we gonna go to begin with? Ooh, yeah, that's a good question. I feel like the mid here might be good, but. Go mid. Uh, yeah, down here. Go for it. Oh, they are really hurting us here. Wow. Okay. Please kill him. Jesus. Oh, he's gonna die, the paladin. Probably. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, we, 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 can't, we can't die like that too many times before we are um, too low in morale to do anything. Um, holy Charm. Another Holy Charm might be good, but we could also go for Brain Sage on the Blood Mage or the Wild Mage. Both pretty good items. I'm gonna do it. At least I think they're good items. Hmm. I might go ahead and stun these guys if they're doing a lot of damage. Stun them. Oh, they're tough. Come on, come on. Don't lose morale. Good. Got that shield up. Another bound element. Um, yeah, it's definitely better than the Champion's Guard, but... Probably also better than the Robes of Absorption, but I don't know. Don't know if I want one more. I mean, it's gonna burn the... Yeah, I mean, yeah, sure. It's gonna burn and help the Wild Mage as well, so why not? 
And he will actually gain quite a lot of defense with this build here, I think. Quite a lot of it. But not enough to be a tank. Definitely not. He got a decent amount of health, actually. Oh. I guess I'm gonna take this and go down here, so I don't have to take that merchant. Okay, uh, yeah, I'm a little bit worried here. Might have to use the holy water if I want to get more morale. Oh, I definitely need to use it. Uh, you know what? No, not worth it. Not worth it. Okay, brawl the wild mage. Yeah, we're doing okay, but we're just. I mean, the paladin is just getting completely killed um, too too early. Take the brain sage. I'm not sure if I want to use it to be honest. Uh, yeah, you know what? It is a little bit better than the holy charm on him. This might even be better than the ho the oak nut just because of the health. He don't really need that much max health, and he's already getting 4% max health from this one, so... Yeah, you know what, he, he should be fine on the Holy uh, holy Charm here. And the Brain Sage. Do anyone want the Oak and Nut here? Probably not. Ah, what a shame. Ah, this fight down here. Yeah, this guy's gonna kill someone. <laughs> Yeah, the ruin. I mean, that's that's a killer. That's just a killer. I mean, I think I'm gonna silence them probably. It's not, it's not gonna be enough. Maybe it is actually because it was this guy doing all the damage. His active is just crazy. So yeah, pretty good part. And upgrade the rose of absorption. I mean, instead of the holy, uh, the noble ward, it's gonna make sure that he is putting up his Aegis a lot more, and that defense might be good. Let's go for it. Don't need that much negate anyway, and the health is not that helpful. The defense is gonna be helpful with the Aegis, and the MP is gonna be helpful when he is attacked, which he is quite a lot. Uh, merchant, nope. Thank you. Nope, nope. We are gonna go for the elites. Holy water, all heroes gain 50% max health next combat. I mean, the mother rat is gonna be pretty hard for us because she got piercing. Twenty gold for that. Uh, is it worth it? I mean, it's worth it if we are winning that battle without losing anyone. Prey of healing might be good as well, but I feel like the max health is even better. Nah, it, it might actually be the max health uh, every three or oh, three seconds. Nah. Yeah, the mother ride is gonna be a little bit tough here, I think. And the brawler is gonna take a lot. Actually, let's move up here so we, the brawler w won't take that much damage because I don't think he can handle that. Well, maybe he can. You know what? Let's let's make sure that he is getting hit by uh, the rats. What can we do here? Um, the shield is probably not that good. Is he doing anything negative to us? No, not really. That is a waste of a burn. <laughs> the shield. I, I feel like the shield might be very helpful anyway. Uh, the, not not the not defense, at least not for the paladin. But the shield might be very helpful for the mage and the brawler. Uh, 
Oh, you know what? Seems like we're doing really good here. Oh, okay, that was a big hit. I did not see that one coming. Okay. Yeah, I'm, I'm, yeah, I don't know. I don't really see... I mean, this might be better. Uh, actually, it, it might be a lot better than uh, the slicer, so... Who are we gonna upgrade? Uh, I feel like the brawler again, actually, because he's doing really well. There you go. Another elite. I don't. I don't ever remember what this is. Oh, it's the grave digger, of course. Right. Um. Oh, please don't. Please don't hit the wild mage. Jesus. Uh, the brawler can take a hit, but uh, yeah. None of the other guys really want to take a hit here. Probably gonna go for the shield here, actually, straight off. Just so they have it when he hit him. Ooh, are you struggling, Kyle, then? Nah, not too much. Looks pretty decent here. We are not losing any health right now. Now we are, but... Did he not hit the brawler yet? Or did the brawler just get full health again? I guess so. That was well. That was good. That was really good. Okay. Uh, 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 that was some bad choices here. <laughs> that was some really bad choices. Maybe the Impaler is uh, actually better than uh, Champion Scott, just because he's gonna do a lot more damage with that. Yeah, he's gonna attack them like he, they got 15 less defense. And the attack is gonna be very helpful for his damage. Uh, I mean, the damage guard is good and all, but he, he's not really a front unit anyway. So he, I, might, I might put it on him again um, when we get the assassin. But I, I, I have a feeling I'm gonna take the assassin here. But I'm not I'm not 100% sure about it. But we'll we'll see. Oh yeah, we can we can handle him. Oh, we uh, actually okay. Never mind then. Uh, Primal thirst or hmm. I don't know. I don't really like that item that much because it's only working for five seconds when someone is dying. I mean, it's it's not that good, especially not against the boss. Okay. So, you're gonna make us bleed. Yeah, that is a little bit annoying. And our active abilities is costing 20% more. And you're gaining... You're gaining that. Yeah, th this could be actually a little bit worrying. Because we got the wild mate who is gonna go crazy with his abilities. So, uh, yeah, you know, that's that's definitely something I'm worried about. Um, Probably need to upgrade the mage soon enough with his shields. But, I think the healing is more important here. Do we have to negate? Yeah, maybe the bleed. Maybe the bleed might be good to negate here. Depends on how bad it actually is. Yeah, I haven't applied any bleed. Well, one bleed, I think. Yeah, okay. Oh, so close! Oh, Jesus, that was so close. Uh, Hero Sigil is quite decent. But we don't really have anyone that is that big of a health pot. I mean, the Blood Mage is, and he don't mind health. But is it better than anything else he got? Uh, I don't know. Shields is just very powerful for us, with the Wild Mage on our team. Let's take it, just to have it. I'm not sure if it's more better than... The Actually, the Holy Charm is not really doing anything back there. At least not a lot. And this one is just gonna give us 128 extra um, shield. And shield is good. Shielding is good. Uh, nah. 
I don't know. Maybe just the shield. This is also pretty good. But he's not really fast at doing... Yeah, I feel like actually doing this just to get more shields. Oh. We could do the merchant now. Because the normal battle here is probably quite bad for us. Wait, did we not get... get, get did, did someone die here? No, no, no. Then, then it would have been shown. Did we really only have 15 or 14 morale before? Okay. This fight is going to be one that we're going to lose, I think. So taking the merchant might be a really good choice here. And then, then we are actually home free. We are home free then. And I think we can take the boss with the gear we have. So let's take the merchant instead here. Okay. Ooh. Oh, that is, that is, oh, that is interesting. Oh, that is also interesting. I mean, that is just really, really good for the mage. Um, you, you can have that. Straight up, you can have that because you're going to go crazy with that. Uh, you probably need the symbiote instead of this great stuff, but 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 still, this is still pretty damn good. Um, right, we we need to get rid of some items here, but we also need to think about who we are gonna take, the assassin. So uh, let's keep some let's keep some items for him. You know what? I might actually take someone else. Because it would, it would be really nice to have an off tank. But we also need someone who can be on... Uh, actually, maybe the Outlaw is not a bad shout here. Putting those poisons up on... Uh, yeah, and then... Yeah, I, I, feel, I feel like the Outlaw might be really strong. And the Outlaw, he also likes to be built as a mage, not really uh, fast here. So that's not good. That's not good because we don't really have anything for him. Um, who else? Ah, oh, that's so... We could also go for a sec... I mean, the druid is not a bad shout, but I don't really want to take the druid in the third act. Nah. I, I'm I'm just not sure who to take here. It could it could be someone like the brawler, you know, the Ronin or someone that can actually be kind of frontlining, but not really. No, I need someone over here. It's probably gonna be the assassin or the outlaw, to be honest. I need someone that can actually be standing over here instead. Yeah, I, I feel like the brawler can handle himself um, for the most part. But he's gonna lose. He's probably gonna lose this build if we are taking the outlaw. Uh, sorry, not the outlaw, the assassin. Just don't have I don't have a scaling item. That's my biggest worry about taking the assassin. Uh, but the outlaw, um, or the, well, uh, I don't know. I, I like to build the outlaw as a mage with symbiote and all that, and the wild mage need need that as well. So what are we gonna upgrade here? I don't really know. I don't really know. Uh, the head, yeah, I feel like this is a really strong item to upgrade on him. Then we need to get rid of some items. And here is the problem. What do we want to get rid of? Actually, this one. We can get rid of that. The Oaken Knot. I don't think we're going to need it. Noble Ward. Nah. Champion Scott. Might be interesting. Primal Thurster. I'm not a big fan of it, but it do have speed. Um, but we need to get rid of some more items. Oh, we got two Champion Scots. Oh, never mind. Let's get rid of them. Slicer, I don't, I don't really like the slicer at all. That's hundred. Okay, I think we're gonna save the re actually this one. We could have just gotten rid of that. Oh, do we want to put? Water of life is never a bad thing to have, but we need to sell one more item to get it. <laughs> do I want it? Actually, I do. I only got seventeen morale, so it's definitely not a bad one to have. 
and the frozen shell. I'm not gonna use that either. So now we actually got enough for both the upgrade and the water of life. That's pretty good. And I'm not sure what I'm gonna upgrade. Fifty. I mean, he's quite fast, isn't he? Yeah, one point six. It's not a bad. It's not a bad thing. But I feel like we might want to go for the holy charm here. That effective, the effective healing on him is quite high because he's got a ninety de defense. So that thirty percent and the extra hundred health is really, really strong on him. Go for it. And take the pot. Yeah. Okay. Good. Look at how good the brawler is with this setup. Uh, right. Uh, do we want to take a normal? I don't think I actually want to take a normal battle. I think I just want to take the merchant and, you know, skip skip ahead. Oh hell yeah! Let's do that. Oh good. God, that's good. That was a really really good event for us. Wow. Okay, sure, I'll, I'll take that. Four defense. Hmm. Um. Yeah, I don't, I don't feel like going for the normal battle with only 17 morale here. Seems like a pretty bad idea. Uh, two times in a row we got this. I, 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 I never, I, I just don't like this item. Uh. Nah, nothing here, nothing here, nothing at all, move ahead. Could sell some items, but I might as well just wait, because I do, I'm not gonna go upgrade anything else here. Uh, event? It's a tough battle, it's a really tough battle. Nah, I'm, I'm, I'm just gonna... I'm, I'm, I'm scared. I'm scared. I mean, I, I like my setup, but I don't like it that much. Hmm. Let's just have it with it in case someone dies. I'm gonna activate it, so if someone dies, they're gonna come up right away. Um, I think I want this instead of the, yeah, let's have that with us, just in case we want to use it uh, for the poisons. Oh, she's hitting so hard. But we are healing quite a lot here. And gaining more shields. But I think I still want to cure all. Make no, actually no. Seems like we're doing really good. Okay, our damage is really... Wow, the wild is going crazy here. Okay, good. I don't like any of these items. The frail might be good on... Um... I just don't understand the frail because if 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 it's only direct damage, if it's only when someone is actually attacking them and not poisons, bleeds, whatever else they can put on me, then it's quite good. But I don't know if that is the case. Uh, I actually need to check that out. So we're gonna take it because we're probably gonna take the assassin anyway. Uh, and if 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 the assassin can just stand there in hidden and have that fifteen percent speed and attack all the time, sure, it's a good item then. But if not. Then, then it's useless. If if he's taking one poison and this is gonna be complete obsolete, then it's not good. But I think I think we're gonna take the assassin. But we'll figure that out in the next episode because I can't I can't I can't. Uh, I need to I need to actually go over all of them and figure out which one I like the most. But probably assassin. But uh, we'll figure that out in the next episode. See you around, guys.